Hi, Hanukkah Sameach everyone and Chodesh Tov, Shabbat Shalom in advance. Tonight is going to be the eighth night of Hanukkah, the festival of Hanukkah, the festival of light. What do we call the eighth night of Hanukkah? It's probably known as Zot Hanukkah. This is Hanukkah. This is a Hanukkah itself. It's a pinnacle. It's a zenith where we're coming into the eighth day, the culmination. We've been building up every single day. According to Bet Hillel, every day we light an extra light. Why we light an extra light? Because we are gathering those lights, those mitzvot. We're coming closer and closer, closer to the redemption. So that's why we keep getting those sparks and we come to the zenith on the eighth day. So very interesting. Why is Zot Hanukkah? Zot Hanukkah Amizbeach. That's the verse, the pasuk. That we're going to say in the eighth day reading in the synagogues tomorrow in the shacharit service. That's what we're going to say. So that's why, because during the time when we're building the mizbeach, when we're building the mishkan, we came to the pinnacle on the eighth day. And whatever we did all the work that we could do, and then on the eighth day, which is supernatural eighth day, because creation is seven days. Eighth day is something supernatural, just like a brit milah is supernatural. Also, the eighth day is also supernatural. What, what was it missing the key ingredient to completion for the completion of everything? It was Hashem's Hashem forming everything. We Ben Adam, us as men, as people, we did all the work that we could do. Then we rely on Hashem to do the rest for us. And that is Hanukkah. That's it's a completion of the time period. And it's no coincidence actually. The mystics actually say that we started off on Elul. We said Slichot for a whole month, many people said. Some people said it for a week, a week and a half. Then came Rosh Hashanah, two days. Then came Yom Kippur, Day of Atonement, we prayed a lot. Then came Sukkot and uh, Hoshana Rabbah and Shemini Atzeret, all the different festivals came afterwards. And they, they say the completion of this time period actually comes on Bet Tevet, here on Zot Hanukkah, because everything that we prayed for, I've asked for, and we've worked hard on, it's finally sealed and uh, it's delivered and it's uh, decreed here on Zot Hanukkah itself. Some people say on Shana Rabbah, when we are doing uh, banging the Arabot, that's the time of the sealing. Some people would say that it's actually here on the eighth day itself of Hanukkah. So this is our chance over here, friends, to take, to work, to utilize at this point in time, to do everything that we can do. And so that all these lights that we've gathered at this point in time, all these mitzvot, all these acts of chesed that we've done, it's coming in a culmination now. And we're going to bring on a bountiful year on for all of us for whatever we say and that is very very important today not to and some people might say oh it's very difficult I, I, i've got an easy life you know i can't become so righteous i can't do this i can't do that but no the complete opposite is true we see in this week's parsha here in parshat miketz what we see in parshat miketz that last week yosef joseph was in a dungeon at the end of last week's parsha he, he was at the bottom. He had everything to be pessimistic about. He was framed by Potiphar's wife and thrown in an Egyptian dungeon. 12 years he was there. But look what happens at the end. He becomes the viceroy of Egypt, the deputy of Egypt. He has the most important position in the whole world because Egypt was a superpower at that point in time. And these are parashiyot here of Miketz, of uh, Vayeshev, like of last week's parasha, they always fall around the period of Hanukkah and very much no coincidence. So we have all the lights in us to become absolutely great, to become superstars. But the trick is not to be superstars just in uh, general acts or whatever we do. The trick would be to become a superstar in Hashem's eyes. That is a pinnacle over here. And that's what friends we have got to do over here. Take all these lights, all these mitzvot and everything that we can do and become the best we possibly can. So wishing you all Izot Chanukah Sameach, Shabbat Shalom and Chodesh Tov for yesterday and take care here. I'll leave you some scenes here. I'm actually in Ikea at the moment here in Israel. So just look all behind and take